That's this is just a quick video to show you how I'm going to do the transmitter. Put the new transmitter in. So if you look at this one here, just put it down a minute. You can see the volts, ground, and video. They're the only three that I need. So I've got three wires here. But you'll notice there's four four holes. So I've followed them back underneath the gimbal. You can take the gimbal out to do this. I've already been under there and had a look. What I've worked out is the first wire on the left is 7.4 volts. The middle wire is the yellow wire which is ground and the third wire is a black which is video. So what I need to do, if you can see that little hole there, the last wire, which is the ground, is it? No, which is video, sorry, is in the end. And there's one in the middle, it should be in the middle. So what I need to do is pop it out and put it in where there's a hole there in the third one. And then it should be just plug and play into there. Now this one is has got five. Same connector, it's just missing the end one. So it will fit in. Once I've got it in, I'll record again and hopefully we can get it working. Okay, so I'm just gonna show you now the wire out, it's got kind of a spade end on that and it clips in. Let's just zoom in on that. So it was in the end one, but it needs to go into the third one. Okay. Let's see there. Focus on that. not let me focus but I'm just trying to show you where I've lifted the little pin up on here so I could pull it out. You can see where two are solved and two are empty. I've pulled out the end one and I'm going to put it in the third one. Okay so there we go we've done it. So you can see the three wires there I've literally just moved them across one and they all fit and they're all in order now. So you see the back, so you've got far left is was the red wire. Then we've got the middle, which is ground, and that was the yellow wire. And then the far right is video and that was a black wire. Then wire is a bit just up above the gim gimbal and it goes and assist all red connector. So I've gone on band A. Three hyphens means six hundred I'm sure it's megahertz or uh, 600 channel 2A and we've got the FPV there on the screen if anyone wants to tell me what would be the best band um, please do, I'm not sure what the best band would be but I've got signal on there I'm going to put it all together and take it out now I'll just show you what I've done with this so I'm getting me antenna me aerial through there um, a little hole there I can see the screen through that little hole and I can push the button through that little hole I probably ain't going to use this much because that's getting hot already and can you imagine it in aluminium even though I've got this cooler on there we'll see how it, how it goes okay thanks for watching